Like and subscribe right now for amazing luck for the next week. Make sure to watch today's full video to see an optical illusion that you must watch if it is Saturday. And not just that, but comment your answers down below in the comment section as we go along. Take a look at this photo here. There's actually three numbers here. Can you read what they are? All right, so the three numbers in this photo are actually five, zero, and three. If you are able to see these numbers, you actually have super good eyesight since only a small percentage of people are actually able to read this. Take a look at these circles. There's actually a letter hidden within these circles. Comment below if you could see it and what letter you think it is. All right, so the letter F is actually hidden within these circles. This one can only be seen by those with really good eyes. Next, we've got this picture here that will test your eyes. Take a look at these two pictures and try to spot the difference between them. I'll give you a short amount of time and if you spot the difference, leave what it is in the comments down below. All right, so the difference between these two pictures is that the moon is missing from the left picture. This one was pretty easy and most people get this one right, but keep watching because things are only gonna get more difficult. Now here there's a picture full of O's. However, within all those O's, there's actually a C hidden somewhere. Can you find it in 15 seconds? Okay guys, so just in case you haven't found it, it's now marked in a red. If you found it in the first few seconds, then that means you're very observant and you can easily distinguish patterns. So if you find it quickly, then give yourself a pat on the back. Next, we've got this photo here where there's actually a butterfly hidden somewhere in this photo. So take some time to see if you can find it and then I'll show you where the butterfly is to see if you were right. All right, so the butterfly is right here. Were you able to see it or was this too hard? Let me know. Next, we've got these photos here. Can you spot the difference between these two photos? All right, so the difference is that the time in the clock is different in the photos. If you spotted this, you must have really good eyes. Next, we've got this picture here filled with the number nine, but there's actually the number eight hidden somewhere in this photo. So try to find it and let me know where it is. All right, so the eight is right here. Were you able to find it or not? Next, we've got this picture here that there's actually a hidden animal inside of. The only way you could see it is if you shake your head left and right over and over again. Try doing that now and then comment down below what animal you did see. There's actually a panda hidden somewhere in this photo. Can you find it? Those only with really good eyes can spot this panda. So let's see if you're one of those people. All right, so the panda is actually hidden right here on the top of the house. If you were able to spot this, I'm very impressed. This photo here will really test your eyesight. There are some circles hidden in this photo. Look at this photo carefully and then comment down below how many circles you see. All right, so there's actually four circles hidden inside of this photo. Were you able to see them or was it too hard? Next, we've got this red circle here that will test your eyesight. So there's actually an animal hidden in the circle. If you could see it, comment down below what you think it is. All right, so there's actually a horse in this photo. If you were able to see it, that is super impressive. Take a look at this photo of the Mona Lisa. Can you spot the difference here? All right, so the difference between these two photos is a ring on her finger. This one is a small difference, but people with really good eyes were probably able to solve this. We've got this elephant here. Take a look at this elephant carefully and try to count how many legs you can see. Some people see four or five or even seven. Comment down below how many likes you see. Take a look at this photo here and comment down below what color you think the strawberries are. 
All right, so if you commented red, you're wrong. These strawberries are actually gray, but your brain is just tricking you into thinking that they're colored when they're actually really not. Next, we got this really cool optical illusion. So this looks like a mountain with a lake at the bottom of it, right? Well, turns out that that's actually not a lake. It's actually just a brick wall. This one tricks a lot of people. Let me know if you fell for this or if you actually knew it was a brick wall and not a lake. Next, we've got this photo that only geniuses can find the difference in. So take some time to see if you can find the difference. All right, so the difference in these photos is actually with the red road sign in the left photo. The S's in the word Brussels are actually backwards. Let me know if you found it. Next, we've got this car seat and there's actually something hidden somewhere in this picture. Take some time and see if you can actually find it out. All right. So the hidden item is actually an iPad. This iPad is sitting right here in plain sight. The case on the iPad makes it blend in with the car seat. So if you were able to spot this one, you have a really good eyesight. Next up, we've got a picture of a lady and a horse. Take a look at this picture carefully and let me know if the lady and the horse are coming towards the camera or if they're walking away from the camera. This one tricks a lot of people and many people also see them traveling both ways. What do you guys think? Are they going forwards or are they going backwards? Okay, so now look to your left. So did you actually look to your left or did you look to your right like the arrow is pointing in? How many Fs can you see in this sentence? I'll give you some time to read it. Was your answer four or five? Well, if it was, then you're unfortunately wrong, as there is in fact six Fs in this sentence. The reason why you most likely count it less than six is because our brain oftentimes skips word such as scientific as it's placed on two lines. Yes, guys, if you are watching this video, it means it is Saturday. So if you are here, you are right on time and it must be Saturday. I'm gonna give you some challenges to complete. Ready? Level one. Guess the word from these emojis in five seconds. Like the video if you guessed it. Now, level two. Find the odd emoji in this image. Subscribe if you completed this level. Now, the hardest level, level three. I have hidden three small hearts in this video, so you have to find all three hearts. You can also rewind the video to find them. Don't forget to comment done if you can find them all. 